Angeles Zoo getting ready for Saturday's public reopening. New safety guidelines are now in place for families who want to make that visit. Fox 2's Patrick Clark is live inside the zoo tonight and joins us now with more. Patrick. Yeah, Sandy, this is the biggest change. You must wear a mask if you're coming to a zoo. Now, I'm going to take mine off so you can understand me and hear me, but they're closed now. Today, they did a little bit of a test run with members to get ready for the public opening this Saturday. Yeah, wondering how far apart it's going to be? About three penguins apart. Yeah, that's six feet. All of this has kind of been like a first date, you know. I mean, I've I've been nervous, anxious, excited, and when people first came, it seemed like really weird because we've been empty for so long. But then, in, in no time at all, it just seemed normal again. At the St. Louis Zoo Thursday afternoon, a member preview day before Saturday's public opening. The zoo using Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday as a soft reopening for members and zoo staff. Operating with new social distancing guidelines, it's still free to enter, but you must make your reservations online and do so seven days in advance. I would say try to get on as soon as you can a week prior. Generally, the reception so far has been just wonderful. We've had great weather during this period of time. The zoo selling out this Saturday and Sunday, their first public opening, expecting about 8,000 people each day. Some of our animals do seem to be happy that our guests are back. Some of the two in particular are behind us, Huck and Finley, our two grizzly bears. I've been watching them all day interacting with our, with our guests. So I think some of them do in fact miss the guests and the interaction. It's a great form of enrichment for them. Yeah, they are really excited. The animals are six feet. That's the distance. Get it? Six feet. That's three penguins length. How far you have to stay apart from each other. And also when you're coming to the zoo, you're going to have to wear your mask. Saturday and Sunday is the days that they're reopening to the public. You must make your reservations online. In Forest Park at the St. Louis Zoo, Patrick Clark, Fox 2 News.